Greetings everyone. In this video, I'm going to really kind of address artists and musicians. Greetings. This infinite source truth is made possible by the generous contributions and support of viewers like you. Please consider making a contribution now. Thank you. Now I want to address artists and musicians for the simple fact that, well, it could also be builders. It could be uh, anyone who creates things and sell things. I'm going to address artists, musicians, architects, anyone who creates a design, a painting, a handicraft, a song, a piece of art, a building, an engineer, all of these things that are creative things, okay? Many take pride, pride in their creations and they want to be known by those creations. And they put their heart and soul into their work. Now, do you hear that? They put their essence into their work. They put themselves into their work. Now, what have you done? What have you done? You created a huge attachment to yourself. An etheric cord. Not just a thread, but a cord. And you as the artist need to cut that cord before you go and sell that item okay this is where the ego has to step back and let go you see because as much of yourself that you put into that piece of art or work And the connection is there. It drains you. Now you need to verify this from your source self connection. Yes, you create things, you put them out there. They live on, whether they're in your home or not. They live on as long as that person, someone else is enjoying them or disposes of them. If you've not removed the etheric connections, the connection, okay, to those things, then they are still attached to you. They're still attached to you. And by them still being attached to you, they can hold an influence and sway over you. Now, where your mind is at in this game, and the pride of your creating or crafting such a fine item or beautiful picture or painting or music or whatever you need to realize that you are a powerful creator and yes you did that wonderful beautiful thing and it's there for many to enjoy but you need to remove the connection to yourself from it now that doesn't mean that you take your name off of well <laughs> that's a signature uh yeah Wow. As an artist, you always want to sign your work, don't you? But that's an ether connection, too. You need to work it out with your source self. You need to work it out with your source self. But be cautious about saying that you put your heart and soul into your work. Recognize what you're saying. And your words have power and they can create connections to you. Now, your source self will talk to you about this if this applies to you. Your source self will, you will get something inside of you going, uh, you might be uncomfortable with me saying this. And because you're resisting. But you just need to be aware. 
you need to be aware. In this experience, it's all about your empowerment and it's all about your synergy cell and your alignment and your ego. And all of these things need to be uh, dealt with and in a beneficial way for you to experience your best life yet, which you certainly can. It's just through choices that you make and decisions that you make. Now, if you benefit from the information that I share in these videos, if they benefit you, then it benefits you to do an energy exchange, to say thank you for the work that I have put out there and the energy that I have put out there for you. You get out of these videos what you put into them. It is an energy exchange and a saying thank you via PayPal or Patreon. It is a frequency unlock that you can unlock no other way because it is an inner work within you. Abundance, health, and prosperity to you.